you know what? You're right. <laughs> You're right. I, um... <laughs> time flies, doesn't it? You know what, though? I, um... I did keep in touch with Jim a lot longer till he, um... Oh, he passed a couple years ago. I'm sorry to hear. Ah, don't worry about it. He, um... To be honest, he... He wasn't really all there in the end anyway. <laughs> The restrictions we introduced two weeks ago were set to expire on Sunday. Today, the expert recommendation is to extend them for a further three weeks until Tuesday, May 5th. Linda and I used to come out here all the time. Yeah, you say. This is actually where we met. Really? Yeah, really. Um, my friend Jim, who was in that photo. Hello and welcome to Odd One Out. We have six people here today who all say that they are DCU students, but one of them is lying. The aim of the game is to figure out who it is. Can you figure it out? There was that thing on the other day, the rag boxing. Didn't work out for Um. It's, I don't know, I don't know where it is. Mm, very oh. suspicious. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> How many uh, floors is there to the U? What if we're leaking the sack around as well, just because you need a little bit of confidence, but competition, you know what I mean? Just yeah. kind of wanted them out. In 2015, video game developer Valve hadn't successfully developed a new project in three years, and was sitting on the weighty expectations of the long-fabled third installment in their Half-Life series. Much to fans and Valve co-founder Gabe Newell's displeasure. Our plan for Half-Life is to get through these three episodes. The main thing that we're uh, working on right now after we get the orange box out the door is going to be episode three. Thank you. Anytime. Hi, Dad. I'm good, yeah. My old friend. Time's been 